most of my patients with dense muscle lung cancer expressing PDL1 that is not above 50% receive platinum doublet plus plumbrolizumab. Though we now have nivolumab and ipilimumab available as frontline treatment options for these patients as well. I have considered nivolumab and ipilimumab for those patients who have PDL1 greater than 1% and either have a low volume of disease or those that may wish to spare chemotherapy. For those patients with PDL1 greater than 50%, I believe that single agent PDL1 directed therapy is efficacious and more tolerable than the mean checkpoint combination. The data certainly look encouraging for patients with PDL1 negative disease, but we do not have FDA approval for this indication, and I currently prefer to use chemotherapy plus pembrolizumab. 